The Rainbow Derby coverage is brought to you by the sire, one fabulous eagle, standing at Royal Vista Ranches in Wayne, Oklahoma. And hello again, everyone. I'm Greg Thompson of StallionEsearch.com here covering the Rainbow Futurity Weekend up here on the mountain. All this coverage is brought to you by the sire, one fabulous eagle, standing there at Royal Vista Ranches in Wayne, Oklahoma. Now, on this episode, we go over to the barn of trainer Heath Taylor, who had the second fastest qualifier going into the derby which is the winner of the Rio Dosa derby and the track record holder impress him impress him flashback broke side by side bumped and now they're separating and trying to keep up Humphrey Pennyworth and then we go to uh, Uroch Mayox in Eastern Shore and impress him opening up on flashback it wasn't much of a battle impress him put flashback away right from the get go impress him from flashback then a photo bat and Tessa Habit and Uroch Mayox you know, the trial was really impressive. Uh, you know, uh, he ran an exceptionally fast time, 2107. It was late in the day. Uh, there was a lot of difference in the racetrack throughout the day. Uh, I think was, some horses had benefits. Some horses didn't have the benefit of winds, tailwinds, rains, even hailed some. And so uh, I thought to run that late in the day with the, the track conditions, it was, uh, it was a really impressive race. Uh, probably the thing that impressed me the most from his trial race is over the course of the weekend, they had 14 trials of the Futurity each day and then 13 between the Oaks and Derby. So they ran 41 grade one trials and there wasn't a horse one out of the one hole in three days. And, and that's probably impressed me more than anything else. As has always been before, I think that, that his whole key to his whole success has been his recovery time. He puts so much into the races and he runs such powerful trial races. And I think in the past, that's been one of the biggest problems. Soundness wise, the horse came out of the race exceptionally well, especially after running that much slop and that slick of a surface. Um, and he's went back to the track and he seems like he has adequate energy and uh, hoping that he'll have enough power to, to run another big one. The fabulous, one fabulous eagle standing at Royal Vista Ranches in Wayne, Oklahoma. The second leading first crop sire of 2020 and the grade one All-American Futurity runner-up winning son of one famous eagle now is a force to be reckoned with, not only with his runners on the racetrack, but also with the gorgeous yearlings highlighting the yearling sales throughout the country. One Fabulous Eagle has produced runners like Jets, earner of $440,000 in his career thus far, and Prairie Meadows Gold Derby winner, Cool and Fabulous, and Texas Classic Futurity finalist, and Ratama Park Derby finalist, Big Eagle Gone. Standing at Royal Vista Ranges in Wayne, Oklahoma, the fabulous, one fabulous eagle.